I think alone is incredibly important, particularly at this time of year. And in a sense, we should all be looking out for people who are on their own, who are older throughout the year. But people just get very busy and stressed with their lives. So I think this is a great campaign. It reminds people at Christmas that people are alone and just to take a time to go and check on your neighbours or check on people you know might be alone and just make sure they're okay. Like even just talking to Alice there today and she was really honest, the lady who did the photo with me, she just got upset and said she is on her own sometimes for days and days. So that's really sad. That's why it's a good campaign and I hope people support it. I suppose I interview a lot of people and have done so over the years, even people in rural Ireland who live on their own and I've noticed and they've told me how lonely they can be. So when they asked me to help the charity years ago, I said yes, because it's a great cause. So I do think it's very important. These people have given their service to the state for decades and now we should be there caring for them and looking out for them. Well, Alone is a charity that works with older people. We work with that one in 10 older people who face challenges in later life. We provide housing for our homeless older people, we provide befriending and support in the community to older people, and we provide a, a commu emergency community response. This time of the year is our biggest time of the year. We're obviously in winter. A lot of the older people we work with um, will be getting out less, the weather, everything else is, and it's Christmas. There's around 120,000 older people live on their own, and so it's quite a challenging time for, for, for people. For a lot of people, it's a time of great joy, but for some people, it's a time of reflection, and it's a time for people who are isolated can feel further isolated. For the last two years, we've had a 50% increase in demand this year and 50% increase in demand last year. And thank God we've been able to meet the need. And like, every, like all charities, we, rel we rely on the generosity of the public and our supporters uh, and on companies who support what we do and for which we're, we're very grateful. I suppose for all charities, the financial cycle should be in reverse. For a charity now, because of the times of austerity and difficulty that we're in, we're trying to expand our services, we're trying to push out and make sure to respond to all of those who come, come to us.